In this quick tutorial, we are going to talk about layers, in particular layer states, what they mean, how to use those. Up on the Home tab on the ribbon, under the Layers panel, you see we have layer properties. Let's just take a quick look at our layers. We have an architectural layout of a building. We just have some simple layers, doors, lighting, power. Nothing filtered out at this point. So under the Layers panel, I'm going to pin it here by selecting the pin, and you'll see it's unsaved layer state. What is a layer state? A layer state is, is a picture of your drawing of the way the layers are stand as they are on your screen. For example, let's create one showing a view of the entire drawing. So I'm going to type layer manager at the command prompt, which brings up the layer states manager. Or we can bring it up here on the ribbon panel. So we're going to do a new layer state. And what we're going to call this one is overall. Entire drawing as it exists or whatever you want to say sometimes I'll get a base map and want to get you know the client version so I save it so what did I just do I created actually a snapshot of the layers that are all exactly the way I write here so the trick about layer states is I can freeze layers here here and here and then type the go into the layer states again here and create a new layer state and call this one new. OK. And I saved a layer state as it stands right here. If I go back to my overall, you'll notice everything showed back up. It's a pretty quick way. So and then we go to new and we've got our new layer state. But I didn't really do anything yet. I'm going to show you a quick trick how to use the layer walk command to walk through your layer states. So I'm going to go back to my layer states again. I'm going to manage those. I'm going to delete my new one right here and hit close. So now we have one that has all of them. So we're going to restore that overall. So we have our entire drawing. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go into the layer walk command, which are these two little feet footprints right there. And we see all my layers are active. We can walk through each of the layers and kind of see. Well, I want to see everything for the exterior. So I want the deck. I'm going to hold down my control key. I want the stairs and the walls and hit right click save layer state and we're going to call this exterior features or exterior exterior features of the home hit ok I'm going to close you'll notice how my layer walk command took me back to my previous but if I go back up to my panel again I'm going to pin it and I'm going to say, look, we have exterior. I'm going to hit that. We have a layer state that took care of the exterior portion of our walls. That is a very quick way to do that. Now, another question you might ask is, well, how I made a mistake. I want the doors on there. So I'm going to go back to my exterior layer state. I'm going to go to manage layer states. I see I have my exterior here. I'm going to edit it. And you'll see it brings up a snapshot of all the layers. Well, actually, we want doors. We want these turned on in this layer, too. And let's just say cabinetry as well. I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to hit Close. And then restore that layer state. And you'll see how the cabinetry and the door showed up in the layer state. Let's try this one more time with the layer walk command. And we'll do it for the electrical. So we're going to do the layer walk. And we're going to just start selecting things. Now we want power. We want power. I'm going to hold my control key down on lighting. Do I want anything else for the electrical? Do I want to show the outside or just that? Maybe appliances. Hit that. I'm going to right click. I'm going to do save layer state. And we're going to call this power. I'm going to hit OK and close. And you notice I'm back at my other layer state. So let's go back to my overall layer state. That's everything there. I'm going to click select here. I'm going to do my exterior features. Everything there. And now I'm going to do my power and have my power. And actually, we do not want the appliances in there, so we're going to do a quick edit to it. I'm going to go over here and manage layer states. I'm going to go to power. I'm going to edit. I'm going to simply turn off my appliances. Is there anything else I think I might need for power? I think I'll turn the walls on just so I can sort of navigate where I'm at. I'm going to hit close. Remember, you have to restore your state, power, and there you go. So we'll go back to the overall. which is right there. 
So using the layer walk command in conjunction with layer states, you can really, really become effective navigating through your drawing and through the disciplines of what you're doing throughout your daily activities. Thank you.